two movies down, three to go. Apocalypse Pompeii. Not the best of movies, but then again, I really wasn't expecting it to be that much in, it. in the first place. A review I read about it before going into this was, you know, just don't expect much. Just think of it as mindless entertainment. For that, I have to say, if this had a slightly bigger effects budget, it might have actually, it, it would probably qualify as mindless entertainment. Um, there were a couple of good points, most notably was, um, John Reese davies uh, performance, possibly the only decent performance in the entire movie, and from what I've read about Apocalypse Pompeii, it's apparently sort of, in a weird way, um, is he this sort of in a roundabout way connects to another movie that I will be uh um watching in this in this series of this serious insanity and that John Rhys Davies is, is also in and has the same character name so I'm sort of billed as it but it was it this this second movie I'm watching was released before Apocalypse Pompeii, about a year year going by John Reese Davies' filmography. Anyway, um, there's a review to follow for this, uh, well, more on the, on the main side, um, and yeah, <laughs> I, I hope you're enjoying, enjoying these uh, little uh, between re between movie updates. Um, I haven't really gone insane yet, but who knows? Who knows? It's still early to tell. We'll know for sure after the next movie.